All right. We have an interesting story uh, from uh, the Ukraine war where North Korean troops that have been sent to reinforce Russian soldiers Mm -hmm. have, for the first time in their lives, been allowed unfettered internet access in Russia, and now they're all addicted to porn. Yo. Yo. Yeah, they did not. Yo, I would have never thought of that, but yeah. I That, of course, it's 10,000 young men it's like what happens to the Mormons when they go to college. You were <laughs> this girl who I went to college with who was a Mormon. And, um, you know, she had never done anything. And then, you know, by the fir- her first Halloween, she had done anal in a, gr- in a gorilla suit. Because she'd been locked in her house for her entire life, you know? So, this makes sense. The North Korean troops have never seen titties a lot. Oh, that must have blown their fucking minds. At first of all, I bet you that fr- I w- I'm so here. I'm so curious. First of all, I want to know what type of porn is the most popular. What do you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. I, I I doubt. Yeah, what type? They probably for sure they're looking at dudes with big dicks like big black dudes with huge dicks they're like what the fuck that's blowing their mind i i do need to point out that you just talked about dicks so damn it (laughs) well you 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 (laughs) you you gave me this how am i hi buddy hi so what's interesting is that in North Korea, they have what's called an intranet, not an internet. Yeah. And it's basically controlled by the state and it's all just filled with propaganda. So yeah. none of, no one in North Korea actually has access to pornography. Dude, no, I get it. I understand that entirely. There's probably a lot of things that are blowing their mind. I, I bet you there's some like special effects. Or some graphic, you know what? I wonder if they have, you know, what's those dudes who do those trick shots? That at a Texas A and M, that's probably blowing their mind too. They, I wonder if they've ever seen Lord of the Rings. Yo, there, there's so much out there that I'm, and they finally get to read about North Korea. <laughs> <laughs> like, what is that? Where I live? Holy shit! Is this what people think about me? That I mean, between the porn. And actually researching their own country, I'm sure it's fucking them up a little bit. But how are they gonna go fight when they're just jerking off all the time? Okay, let's let's. I'm gonna guess top three types of porn that they're looking at. Okay. Um. All right. I mean, actually, it at this point they're starting off on basic level. They haven't got into the crazy shit yet because they don't. It's like when you first start looking at it, you're like, that's a titty. He's grabbing titties. Or you might even just be looking at just naked people. You don't even have oh, looking at Also, it, it's Russian internet. So, like, they're not getting access to all the US sites right away. It's all the Russian sites that they're getting access to. Dude, I'm sure Russian porn is fucking filthy. Are you kidding? Oh, yeah. And German porn? Oh, German porn is FIB, baby. <laughs> <laughs> they're going straight FIB I bet you Russian porn is not gentle it feels <laughs> like some like real heavily clothed a lot of vodka you know people oh dude I bet you those that breadline porn is amazing <laughs> <laughs> people Yeah, dude. People, it's like instead of the pizza delivery guy, it's just it's they're in the bread line, you know. How many loaves of bread you got? Down on chicken. Yeah. So North Korea basically sent ten thousand troops to help with the Ukrainian war effort, and according to this source, the soldiers, the North Korean soldiers, have been quote unquote gorging on pornography ever since they've gotten access to it. Yeah, I honestly am not sure. I'm super curious by that word gorging. I know what it means, but gorging on pornography feels like they couldn't come up with a word 
that sufficiently described how much porn they were watching. Like, they're not going to do well out on the battlefield with one hand on their dick. It's going to be harder to shoot the gun, from what I understand. No pun intended. I mean, I... Okay. So it's 10,000 dudes who have never seen porn or really anything on the internet before. They've never seen anything about North Korea. They've never seen that. What? Let me ask you this. What else do you think besides porn? Like, what's the next thing? Video games? Are they... I don't know how much video games they get to watch. I, I don't know. TikTok recipes? Like, what are they... I just can't imagine being a grown human male. And they're probably anywhere from 18... Let's say 18. And you have access to porn... For the first time. That has got to be so distracting. And I might defect right away. I'd be like, I'm not I'm not going back there. Are you kidding? They get titties over here in Russia. The interesting thing about porn is that you don't need to speak a different language to process it. No, right? it's it's universal language. Yep. Titties are titties are universal. This is true. Wow, what else does it say in the article? Anything good or is that it? That's pretty much the best part of it. It's A lot of it's just kind of uh, talking about the Ukrainian war and stuff like that. But uh, there, there, there's this one paragraph that says that a spokesman for the U.S. Department of Defense responded after the claims concerning North Korea's soldiers' internet habits gained traction. And uh, they basically said that they are unable to verify any North Korean internet habits or virtual extracurricular extracurriculars in Russia. Do you know what? Honestly, we might be seeing the downfall of North Korea right now. We don't have to bomb them. We just have to fly over their airspace and drop a lot of porn. Do you know what I mean? You know how they drop... <laughs> you just drop a bunch of hustlers and playboys and be like, look what you're missing! <laughs> People, it would be... An, it would cause an uproar. You, you figuratively disarm them. Oh, are you kidding? That would be crazy. And be like, look what Kim Jong-un has been keeping from. They would lose their mind. Hey, if you like this podcast you just watched, you're going to love the one I'm popping up in your face right now. Check it out.